Hello, I'm Emily, and welcome to Indiana Radio's first broadcast. Now, for all of those who are wondering, what's Indiana Radio all about? I'll fill you in. I love music. I also love getting to experience new music from my own backyard. Indianapolis is on the verge of something great when it comes to the music scene. And I'm here to help promote the bands that are making it happen. And as a musician struggling to get my name out there, I know how difficult it can be to spread your name. So if you're interested in being featured on this program, feel free to shoot me a tweet at twitter.com slash indiana underscore radio or message me at Facebook, facebook.com slash indiana radio show. All of the music featured will come from Indiana musicians who are relatively unknown that should be promoted. As time passes, I'll be discovering more and more musicians, hopefully with your help. The music styles will vary in each upload, so be sure to check back if you didn't hear something that you liked. Support music, support your local artist, and rock on. This week's episode features music from local Indianapolis musician, Parentheses, also known as Melatonin. Information about this artist and the songs that you've heard today can be found in the description.
picture without using my words The lines might be shaky and the signature obscure But it's me I swear my pure intentions don't lie If this art was my existence I would paint all the night The palette see no color and the concepts never change Cast it on the canvas is the shadow I can't claim But it's mine I swear and I don't want it anymore I'll just let the breath out If that sinner is reborn Is impossible to sum And washing out the colors Guarantees that you'll become Like me Enclosed in the ego's Fragile box Just a speck, diminished dot Just an afterthought I could be a poet With nobody around Silence in my thinking To never read aloud But to myself I've got the time To listen close Tell me now who else can see my ghost? Thanks for tuning in. This is Emily, and this was Indiana Radio.